everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome i'm ember rose also known as the religious hippie you can basically follow me on any social media platform and don't forget to check out my official website at the religious hippie.com so this is basically going to be my soca slash colorado vlog i apologize for the sound i am not going to take my microphone with me because it's going to be this huge hassle and i don't need to deal with it um so currently we are on our way to chick-fil-a and then we are going to the airport Can I just get an eight count chicken nuggets? everybody so it is officially day two I haven't even been in Colorado for more than 24 hours yet so my manager Anthony is picking me up and we are going to go sightseeing in Denver Colorado since he lives here um, so he's gonna show me around we're gonna go get some food because to be honest I'm starving um, and we also have to stop at Target because I am already down like four wardrobes and I need a few more to get me through the week I don't know why I thought that I could live off of four shirts for the Soka conference, everybody is checking in today, so there's not really much for me to do there, um, but I am going to go later to go to John's talk. But before then, I brought my crucifix with me. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Ooh, there we go. Um, so I'm going to do some morning prayers really quick, and then we are going to get picked up and start our day. So it is now almost seven o'clock. I just got back to my hotel eating some strawberries. So now what I'm gonna do is I am going to do my homework. I am going to eat some strawberries um, and hopefully get to bed early today 
um, to give my body a little bit of extra resting time for tomorrow. And I'm really excited. So yeah. Hey everybody, welcome to day two and a half, three-ish. So Anthony's picking me up now. I actually have to head down because he just got here. He just texted me. Ignore the mess in the background. Um, I'll show you the fit real fast. The lighting in here is terrible, but this is what I'm wearing. So yeah, now we are off to some conferences. Exciting stuff, guys. How many here attend the Latin Mass exclusive? Okay, I'm on the So today has been a very busy day. I am very tired, but there is a ball tonight that I want to go to because there are some people there that I really want to talk to. Um, so I have a friend picking me up, um, actually in a couple minutes. Uh, so I am basically dressed for the ball, so to speak. Um, I guess I can give you guys an outfit inspo. So you guys have seen this dress before because I've worn it to a couple weddings. Um, it's, a, it's a dress that I really like wearing. It's, it's very cute. It flows out too. Um, I don't know if I can show how it floats. Hang on. So anyways, yeah, this is one of my favorite dresses. Um, but I need to get my purse and hopefully I don't decide to take my shoes off later because usually I like to go barefoot. But yeah, that's the game plan right now. I'm sorry I haven't really been talking that much in this vlog. There's not really that much to talk about. Um, I've literally just been showing you guys everything we've been doing. Uh, but anyways, so now we're off to the ball. Good morning everybody, and it is officially my last full day here in Colorado, which is so sad because I absolutely love it here. I love being able to meet everybody, see the mountains. It's just been a wonderful experience overall. But right now, Mary and Anthony are gonna pick me up really quick uh, to go to Mass. We're going to Our Lady of Mount Carmel. It's a traditional Latin Mass parish, so I am very excited for that. Um, and then my talk is today, and then Kevin is right after me. But overall, I am very excited for today. I think it's going to be wonderful. I hope my talk is able to impact people or make sure that they know that they're just not alone in these things that they're facing because that's how I felt, and I don't want anyone to feel that way. Um, and that's the whole reason I started my ministry was so that people who were in the position I was or went through the same things I did don't feel like they're alone um, and that there is hope and you can go back to Christ. So I got my St. Benedict medal. St. Benedict be popping today. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to Mass, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so now we are on our way to the gala with Bishop Strickland and a bunch of other people. I'm literally just wearing the exact same thing I wore yesterday. And what I want to share with you that I believe this Soka is really all about. Hey guys, 
guys, so I'm officially back home. It was a super fun night. Um, Kevin just dropped me off and I am now packing because I have to check out tomorrow pretty early. And then we're going on a hike at like 8 a.m. And then after that, I'm not really sure. Um, but my flight isn't until later tonight tomorrow, or later at night tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry, it's really late. It's like 2 a.m. right now. Um, it's just the oxygen. Um, I need to pack and everything, so that's basically what I'm going to be doing. It's pretty boring, but, you know, whatever. And then I am gonna sleep on the plane so well. It's gonna be amazing. Second time on a plane, right? 